slather on the slime. Prepare to get pretty, America, because the slimy beauty trend has reached your shores. If you didn't already know, snail mucus works miracles on skin. Just look at the millions of South Koreans with poreless, glowing faces. Snail secretion filtrate is chock full of collagen and has anti-aging benefits. These days, the Koreans are less into it, having since discovered other weird, all-natural ingredients. So snail slime is setting its sights on the U.S., where the clientele can hopefully get past the ick factor and give it a go. Target, Ulta, and CVS have been stocking up and now have a treasure trove of K-beauty stuff between them. The feedback has been mostly positive, so the trend could prove to be as ridiculously successful in the States as it was in Asia. Guess we'll find out soon enough. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Snail slime is actually pretty tame compared to these odd skincare trends. Beauty blogger keeps skin soft and glowing with sperm facials. Beauty blogger Tracy Kiss has just come out with a skincare treatment for sensitive skin that's sure to excite men the world over. Semen facials! A lifelong sufferer of rosacea, the 28-year-old former model was looking to ease her red problematic skin and turn to a remedy she claims does wonders for her inflamed skin. 100% all-natural, active and live man juice. Since semen builds babies who come out of the womb with soft glowing skin, Kiss reasons it'll do the same for her. She waxes poetic about the sperm facial, saying, It feels like a face pack that pulls the skin inwards. It feels so glossy to wipe it off. It's like having a kind of oil on the face or a wax, where it just glides beautifully against the water. It's so cooling and soothing. A friend supplies Kiss with a steady supply of semen, harvesting his spunk and delivering it to her via Chinese takeaway tub. But those in a relationship may opt for direct delivery, as their partners will no doubt appreciate being given a hand every morning. While Kiss recommends massaging sperm into your skin for 20 minutes before rinsing with water, experts recommend including semen in your regime after you've tried voodoo, a rabbit's foot, and keeping your fingers and toes crossed. Which is to say, maybe not ever. French YouTube star encourages young fans to burn themselves. With great power comes great responsibility. A famous saying known around the world, but one that sadly apparently never made its way to the part of France where YouTuber Mari Lopez, aka Enjoy Phoenix, lives. Despite amassing a legion of francophone and international teens and tweens as followers, Marie nonetheless thought it'd be a good idea to recommend the impressionable youngsters rub an allergenic spice all over their faces. A suggestion that, unsurprisingly, came with some unwanted side effects. Among Lopez's four natural homemade face cream recipes in a video all about DIY face masks was one made of just cinnamon and honey. Yep, citing its apparent antioxidant and regenerative characteristics, the 20-year-old last week recommended her nearly 2 million subscribers cover their faces in cinnamon. That's right, cinnamon. A spice French dermatologist reacting to Enjoy Phoenix's dumb advice told local press was harmful to the skin and may cause allergic reactions in some. And they were right. A bunch of Phoenix's fans didn't enjoy her recommendation and reported getting burned by the cinnamon. Oops. For her part, Lopez isn't taking a Harry Truman-esque buck stops here approach and admitting the error of her ways and promising to do better by her adolescent fans in the future. Nope. Her lengthy Facebook post, responding to the mini-controversy, turned most of the expected mea culpas into theia culpas, and saw her partially explaining to fans, who might have been burned, that they should have tested the mask on their skin before fully applying it. Yep, it's all their fault. Sick Beauty, a new makeup trend is taking Japan by storm. How would you define beauty? Would how healthy a person looks factor into your definition? Well, apparently it wouldn't at all for today's Japanese high schoolers. Following on the heels of the popular confused face makeup from a few years ago, Japanese teenagers nowadays like to apply makeup in a way that makes them look like an aged doll, as well as emaciated and ill. 
Say hello to Sick Face Makeup. Japanese pop idol and Nogizaka 46 member Shirai Shimai is a natural when it comes to looking both sickly and beautiful. You could even say she was born to be the perfect ambassador of the sick face makeup look thanks to her deathly pale skin and large eyes. Numerous Japanese websites and magazines now include guides to teach Ting how to apply the makeup style. Apparently, the key is perfectly horizontal doll-like eyebrows and eerily pale skin. But if that's too difficult, as long as you look both innocent and pitiful, you're good. Shirai Shimai looks great when she's sporting the style, but results vary when your average Japanese girl tries it on for size. What do you think? Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Tomo News Beauty Tips presents Korean Eye Bag Trends for 2015. Have you been trying to get rid of those puffy bags that started appearing under your eyes in high school? Well, stop it! According to South Korean fashion mavens, they're now the hottest thing since sliced cucumbers. Now, Korean men and women have gained a reputation for beauty, but it's not much of a secret that they often get a little bit of help from nip and tuck docks that are as ubiquitous as kimchi. Check out this pic. Each of these women are actually different people, despite the fact that they are likely all named Kim or Park. Chiseled noses, reshaped eyelids, pointed noses, and boob jobs are all well and good. But if you don't have puffy eyes, you're ugly. Called Egyosol in Korean, the trend might be translated in English as eye smiles or winsome baby eye fat. Here's K-pop member So Hyun from Girls' Generation rocking the look. Korean beauty bloggers say this kind of puffy eye is different from the I work 26 hours a day in a job I hate eyes. When done right, Eggyosort makes eyes appear rounder and more intense. There's even a K-pop eye bag appreciation website. And yes, there are products to help those of us who are unlucky enough to be born without the pudge. So there you have it. Puff up those eye bags and start looking beautiful. Korea style.